Honey tonight, make it all right. Turn on your smile for me for a while. Take me away from where I have been. I know you love me. Love me over again. Usually I do the mic check and then edit that out. But I want you bastards to suffer because... The power of Hershey's compels you! Some people might know it is Chocolate Bunny Day tomorrow. You know how hard it is, actually impossible, to find a chocolate crucifix? I look high and low. I looked on internet. There's no chocolate crucifixes out there. Would you eat me? I'm made out of milk chocolate. Uh, put me out of my fucking misery by eating me. I found a chocolate plus sign or multiplication sign. No crucifixes. You know why I wanted a crucifix to eat. To eat the penis first. But it is impossible to find the chocolate crucifix out there. All they have is the chocolate crosses. I was going to, you know, like, try to eat the penis. You know, like, try to break the penis off. And it's just like, eh, eh, it won't come. But the whole fucking joke is just, I can't even make it, even though I just did. Because there's no fucking penis on this. I want my penis crucifix milk chocolate. Damn you Hershey people. But no. Think of the jokes out there that I could have done. Fuck you Hershey's. The question of course is always what part does a real true Christian eat first? The head, where all the thorns and the, the eyeballs and the brains are. You know, like left arm, right arm. You start with the uh, disgusting toenails first. You know, I, I would hope that they would like, you know, get the dirt out of underneath the toenails first. I figure if you eat the head first, it kind of puts him out of his misery way too soon. I mean, the whole fucking point is he was supposed to suffer for us. So if you'd like start at the feet and just like nibble upwards towards his crotch, suffers longer. <sighs> so my question to everybody out there, what part of Jesus do I eat first?